I've recorded this review for the third time and I've been facing errors after errors that I cannot get away. So, um, you know, sometimes you gotta redo something in your life. Hello everyone in the internet, it's Ipan from Justcription and today I'm going to be reviewing a video microphone. So yes, I have a microphone over here and I think you have seen this microphone before. This is the Boya BYBM 2021 and I've been using this microphone for quite a while now so I think it is now the best time to review it. So let's get to the specifications. So this microphone is a super cardioid video microphone so the polar pattern is narrower than the normal cardioids and in aspect of the frequency response this microphone has a frequency response of 40 hertz to 20 thousand hertz and in terms of the output connection this microphone uses a 3.5 millimeter connection and the cable is detachable and changeable so if you have a longer cable because the cable that comes with this microphone is very very short so you might want to get yourself a longer longer <laughs> i cannot even speak english today a longer odds cable all right and if you are planning to use this microphone with an audio interface like the Focusrite or the behringer make sure you have an audio adapter like the rode lslr plus uh, to convert the 48 volt phantom power to probably like 2.5 volts 5 volts, 6 volt, 9 volt because this kind of like microphone doesn't take too much voltage and if you drive too much voltage to this kind of like microphone that doesn't take too much voltage there's a high chance that you are going to break this microphone so beware please before I start testing this microphone I just want to state the gain that uh, I'm currently using so the gain is set at 25% on the Canon EOS M5 so yes we are using the Canon's preamp because this is a video microphone so this is marketed for like you know like videographers um, content creators something like that so we are plugging this microphone to a camera to give you the best uh, the best like result from this microphone first thing first we are going to test the polar pattern of this microphone so this microphone as i stated just now is a super cardioid video microphone so it should be insensitive at the side and it is going to be really really insensitive at the back so right now i'm speaking at the front of the bm 2021 so let's get to the first side so this is the first side of the um of the bm 2021 so this is how it sounds like it should sound you know it should sound lower than how it sounds at the front and man i do not know how to how to manage cable but right now we are speaking at the rear of the bm 2021 let's get to the second side and this is the second side of the BM2021, how it sounds like. Now we are at the plosives test. So we are going to test the microphone in terms of how it, it handles the uh, plosives with and without the windscreen. So first thing first, let's, you know, test this microphone with the windscreen. Peter Pan pick a pack of pickled peppers. 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 So now for the last test, we are going to test the proximity of this microphone. So let's get really, really close to the microphone. So right now I'm very close to the microphone and I might clip the microphone. I'm speaking really, really close to the microphone. And this is how it sounds like. Is it very bassy? Bassy? Man, I just lost my voice right there. And right now the microphone approximately 30 centimeters away from my mouth and this is how it sounds like. So now the microphone is over here and it is now approximately 70, 65, 60 centimeters away from my mouth and this is how the microphone sounds like. Now we are going to be comparing this BM2021 by Boya with probably one of the famous budget microphones around under 20 bucks so it is the boya mm ones 
So I think a lot, a lot of people actually use this microphone because it's really, really cheap and it sounds good for the price. So I think it's fair to compare this microphone with this microphone because the price, I think this microphone is half of this microphone's price. So um, yeah, let's compare these two microphones. Ladies and gentlemen, right now I'm talking to the Boya MM1 and this is how the Boya MM1 sounds like. And now we are back at the Boya BYBM2021, ladies and gentlemen, and this is again how the BM2021 sounds like. So um, let's, uh, let's hear both of these microphones back to back. The Boya MM1 BM2021, the Boya MM1 BM2021, the Boya MM1 BM2021. Alright, so what is my overall thought on this uh, Boya BYBM2021? So I think this microphone is actually a decent microphone for its price, alright? And to think uh, of how rare a super cardioid microphone in the price range of 25, 30, 35 bucks or in Malaysian ringgit it will be like around 100, 110, 120, something like that. It depends on where you get this microphone. Um, this is actually a good deal and it actually sounds good. It actually has a good quality of sound. I mean, it produces a good quality of sound, but this microphone definitely has some cons. So this is actually based on experience of using this microphone. So I have two cons that I could state about this microphone. So for the first con is the proximity effect. You will get super, super bassy light like even bassier than this microphone I have over here, like, yeah, these microphones, you will get super bassy when you, when you are really, really close to the microphone, like very, very bassy. So my tip for that is make a good distance between your mouth and the microphone. So you will not sound too bassy because of proximity effect. And the second con that I have found out about this microphone is that the microphone doesn't handle plosive really well even with the provided windscreen on the microphones and I think that the provided windscreen doesn't really help uh, with plosive very much so uh, my tip my advice for that uh, problem is you watch this video yeah you watch this you watch this video and yeah you will get your uh, plosive problem solve most of the times not all the time most of the times so yeah that's it for my review of the boya bym 2021 what do you think about the sound of this microphone for me it sounds good for the price okay for the price or do you like the sound of the boya by mm1 more than the boya by bm 2021 that we are reviewing in 2021 coincidentally uh tell me at the comment section below and yeah, that's it for this video. If you have any suggestion for the next video, you can also tell me in the comment section below. And yeah, thanks for watching. Bye-bye.